Hi guys, what we're going to be cooking today is a beautiful simple meal, chicken piccata. Okay, so let's prep the sauce. I've got a shallot, and what we're going to do is just finally dice it. And you want it pretty fine. Slice some mushrooms, thinly sliced. And just roughly chop some sun dried tomatoes. I love sun dried tomatoes. I got some beautiful pimentos and just roughly chop them. Some beautiful garlic. Okay, chicken piccata, absolutely fantastic. One of my favorites. Beautiful Italian dish. Um, also, you can use veal, uh, but we're using chicken. And uh, piccata means uh, zesty, tart, um, tangy, beautiful. So what I've got here is a lemon, and um, obviously lemons used in chicken piccata. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try and get the maximum flavor out of this lemon. Okay, so cut your lemon in half, and then one half the lemon, add some sugar, because we're gonna caramelize this. Beautiful. I've got a pan on a medium heat, and make sure it's a non-stick pan for this. And just a touch of olive oil in there. Add your lemon, and we're going to caramelize this, and that's going to be fantastic when I squeeze it into that sauce. Full, full of flavor. And guys, take advantage of your produce. Look at that, absolutely fantastic. That's caramelized, that's beautiful and sweet. All them sweet lemony juices there, and that's going to be fantastic when I squeeze it into the sauce. Beautiful. Okay, I've got like maybe five ounce chicken breast, and uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut it in half. Um, there's no need to actually pound it, um, but you can use a meat bat and pound it if you want, but there's no need. And when you're cutting any ingredients, always have your hands flat, not like that, have it flat, so you don't cut yourself, and then just simply cut it in half. Like that. Season your chicken with salt, just lightly, not too much. ground black pepper and do that on the other side just lightly coat your chicken in some plain flour to get your pan on a medium to high heat and we're going to add some olive oil in and basically what we're going to do is just brown them on each side of the chicken beautiful the golden brown on each side, take them out, and then we'll do the sauce. Look at that, beautiful. Look at that, absolutely fantastic. I've got beautiful, beautiful chicken juices. I've got some fond from the bottom and that'll make the sauce even more fantastic. So keep this, this is gold dust. Okay, so now we're gonna deglaze the pan with some white wine in. And it just lifts all that flavoursome goodness. Next add the shallots in. Next add the garlic in. So just gently cook the garlic for about two minutes. So next add the mushrooms in. Give it a good stir. Next add the capers. And use that brine too. Some dried tomatoes in. Pimentos in. and a good pinch of sage, beautiful. Okay, next add your chicken stock in. So what I'm gonna add now is that beautiful caramelized lemon, straight in there, beautiful, in. So sweet, mm. beautiful. So now just reduce that sauce by half. Okay, I've put the chicken back in the pan. And what we're going to do is add a little bit of butter to the sauce, just to give it some sheen. Let's have a taste. Mm. I don't really have to season that because I put the capers in there, they're pretty salty anyway. Um, but um, that is beautiful. And that's the consistency you want. 
beautiful. And just to finish, a nice, generous parsley. So there you go guys, that's my version of chicken piccata. Absolutely fantastic, simple to do, very, very tasty, very tangy, beautiful. Thanks guys.